tough loss, but a bright spot in, his, in that is you had 89 yards and a touchdown there late in the third. Take me through that uh, almost interception touchdown for you. Um, I mean, we, we've we practiced that play a ton. It was, it was open early, but Zach had to step up, and that cornerback just made a good play and should have intercepted that, but, I mean, luckily this ball was just right in front of me, so I just grabbed it, but... Yeah, I mean, it's hard to celebrate and be super pumped when it should have been an interception and we're down by 20 points, but just glad I caught it, yeah. I was going to say, you didn't show much emotion when you got that touchdown pass. Yeah, I kind of just wanted to get off and get going, but I mean, there's not much you can celebrate when we're down by so much, so it's kind of disappointing. Washington obviously has a great defense. What impact, though, did turnovers make in this game? Um, I think we made them look a lot better than they truly were. They're a really good team, but we just are mistakes. And I mean, I had, a, I had a couple mistakes that I'm not too happy about. And just as, a, as an offense, we didn't do too well. So yeah, those mistakes made them look like world beaters out there and it killed our drives. And yeah, we're just looking forward to Toledo now. You had a, a tough September and you guys came out two and two against some really good power five teams. When you think of the beginning of the season and if you could look forward to see that you guys were two and two after September what would you say um, I mean any team would hope to be 4-0 at this point but I don't think many people thought that we'd be at the point that we are right now being two and two beating a good team so I mean wins are great but I mean we yeah we, we just want to win as many as we can throughout the rest of the season we want to win out so we're gonna we're gonna learn from our mistakes and keep going in September, you kind of had some the highs of highs and lowest of lows. Where do you feel like the what's the state of the football program right now? Um, I think we're just determined to to prove that we're better than we were that we showed today. Uh, we just we put pretty bad film out for ourselves, and it, it just wasn't fun. So um, our state is we're just really determined to focus on Toledo and do all we can to beat them. Your head coach, Kalani Satake, walked off the field. He was still clapping. He thanked the fans for being here, and you guys walked in the locker room. I'm sure it wasn't all happiness once you went into the locker room, but what was his message to you guys? Um, it's this, the same thing, just he's always saying, I mean, we have fans coming out here. We have parents, family members flying out to see us. So just when it's game time, you got to be focused on game time. When it's family time, you just got to focus on the family. So you can't let it just hurt the rest of your weekend. We just need to own our mistakes and keep moving. We just didn't show our best football, and that's, that's basically what he said. All right, Matt, thanks so much for the time. No problem.